big cliche g'day folks and welcome to my video with a little bit of a difference I've been away for a couple of weeks I was a little generous with my bandwidth and it got sucked to death um, so I have had to be away but I am back I'm bad and I'm ready and raring to go so just starting off with something very silly what I'm what I'm gonna be doing is walking through a couple of the builds that I've done over the last couple of months um, well three four months maybe the one I am standing in front of right now is my least impressive because it is my oldest but what I had to do with it is what um, what makes the difference so I'm currently in desired crafts economy server uh, what I did months ago was buy a plot which was tiny so I built up um, not overly impressive uh, oh I should mention also that these plots were on water um, so there was like grass too thick two layers thick to get through um, it's not grass water to get through let me just put that back on so I've got my little indicator uh, so what I had to do was fill in right underneath with dirt with dirty dirt to be able to do all you are seeing here so yeah as I say not overly impressive but somebody stole my fence my animals are gone. Oh, people are just rude. I haven't been here in months. Yep, somebody's stolen all of my animals and... Okay, well that was disappointing to say the least. Um, I'm not going to bother <laughs> showing any more of that. You leave the server for a couple of months, come back and your place has been trolled. Uh, I shouldn't have expected much less. So moving on. Um, I've actually quickly had a look at the next one just to make sure that it hasn't been uh, messed about with. But here we go. From a simple little fountain. So cute. Up here to the recreational area. So this is, as I mentioned, Desire Craft. And this is in Tropical Resort. Slash RGTP Tropical Resort. It is up for sale at the moment. If anybody out there does play the Desire Crafts economy server. Now, as you can see, this is my beach volleyball court. Started off as a tennis court. Uh, there's loads and loads of mobs underneath me, so that's all the noise coming there. And my cute little glass bottom gazebo here. It has got water in it. So, yeah, this is uh, builds number two and three from what I'm going to show you today. Moving on, still staying in Desired Craft, uh, but I am heading over to Pumpkin Patch. Now, Pumpkin Patch is a region that was started by our good friend, Ysera the Dreamer, better known as Chris the Awkward Penguin. I'm just going to move away because those spiders are bugging me. And don't know where it came from, but there was a sudden idea that we wanted a region that was Alice in Wonderland themed. So I will meet you over there. Okay, folks, and welcome to Pumpkin Patch. This is, like I mentioned, this is still in Desired Craft. This is where I start being a little bit prouder of myself. I start getting a little bit more creative because I'll turn you around and bam, this is my home in Pumpkin Patch, the Alice in Wonderland theme. This is my teapot. I love my teapot. Look at that. Isn't that funky? Oh, that's so cool. <sighs> oh, I do love my teapot. So just around the corner from my teapot, I have kitties. I started building this Sarah the Dreamer's home. Now, what queen of a region couldn't have a castle? So I, I was building her a Queen of Hearts castle. It's more outside than in. But the one that I love, functional and funky, is over here. Our Mad Hatter Hat. Now I'll tell you what to do this without fly to be able to see this and get some semi okay angles. I'm pretty happy with it. Uh, it was a bit difficult. So yes, this is the Mad Hatter's hat. But as I said, the functionality of it. It's a farm. So yeah, this is four levels up. Sheeps. Actually, no, it's five levels up. There we go. I'm just going to quickly press... There we go. Doesn't work anyway. And mushrooms. So this is our Mad Hatter's Farm. I only have one more build to show you. Wow, they're noisy. 
uh, one more build to show you here, which is actually a work in progress. I will stand with that behind me. Look at that. Uh, yes, it's a work in progress, and I'm going to take you over to what we've affectionately started calling the Penguin server, which is a TG Adam and your Sarah the Dreamers server. TG Adam being the daddy or Han Solo of Chris the Awkward Penguin. Um, so I will meet you over there and show you my little work in progress. Be right back. Okay, guys, I'm over here in our, what we've called Penguin server. I know I, this is a build showcase, but I couldn't be over here without showing you my little babies, which I just think this is absolutely hilarious. You could hear them. This is Mary, Kate, Ashley, oh, there she is, and my little boy, oh, Olsen. <laughs> Who would have thunk? And you can go in, you can go in and pat them. I've done a double gate so they can't get out, but these are my little my little guys. Mary Kate, Ashley and Olsen. Oh, I love baby slimes. Okay, now the main reason I'm over here, this is my somewhat almost pride and joy. My greenhouse. No longer my greenhouse though. I have moved on to bigger and better. I did, uh, as I, I did say, that it, I was going to show you the work in progress first, but I couldn't have come here without showing you this. So this is my greenhouse. All of this, every single part of this has been done legit. Finding the resources, smelting, blah, 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 blah. Oopsie. That's not right. And also done without fly. So, yeah, it, um, it, took, it took some time. Actually, it didn't take that long because uh, I have no life, so I don't really do much else with my time. Let me just sort that out because that's that's just wrong. We had some slimes jumping up and down in here before, so that could have been why. But yeah, I really I really love this greenhouse. I've moved on to uh, this is my my little warped carrot, and I've moved on to carrot three. I'm gonna do something very similar to this but it's probably going to be about four times as big so collecting the resources for this is going to take a good amount of time next up is the last up the last build i'm going to show you guys today because you're probably already bored and that's fine because uh, i'm not i love doing this i absolutely love doing this so i'm going to take a quick warp over to uh, carrot three and uh, show you what is my build in progress I'll be back with you in a moment. Okay, folks, so starting here in my tree farm, which is going to be quite a good deal bigger once the update comes through. Uh, as you can see, it's only got the four different types of wood. The acacia is going to still be added. And if I figure out the uh, old or dark wood, if it actually is any different from spruce wood, that's going to be added as well. So it could well be six plots rather than four but my pride and joy which i only started a few days ago this is the work in progress this is carrot three's mansion oh wet noodle dirt in front of the door and i will explain give me i will explain that in a moment but uh yeah i really really love this i think this is so cute Over here, love, 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 my water wheel. I think this is great. This is fantastic. Started doing some terraforming out the back with the help of my little buddy Ryan, who is actually, uh, let's see, he'll get him to say hello. He's not going to do it, is he? He's not going to do it. Yay! <laughs> Hello, YouTube. Um, this area out here was really rocky mountain. Well, not really rocky. It was, it was, it was hilly. It was hilly, we'd say, um, at least. Let's get rid of that. There we go. And uh, my little buddy, Ryan, came and helped me with this to clear it out. So see, as you, there we go, work in progress. Still trying to figure out how the roof is going to go. Uh, there's a stairwell. You can see where the, um, the glass is heading in an upwards direction. So that's a stairwell, which I was thinking of leading into a bit of a mage tower. Uh, I don't know who was banging on the door. So I will head inside and show you what's going on here. 
Let me just put the dirt back because there is a reason for the dirt. I shall explain. Okay. Isn't this lovely? It almost looks kind of barn-like, but there's going to be another floor. So where the triangle window is, that will be like third floor, uh, second floor. Mezzanine area. I'm actually thinking that the third floor up there will be a mezzanine above the mezzanine. <gasps> Have you ever seen that before? I don't think so. So head upstairs here. Lovely little angled room. Window into the water wheel. I think that's a nice little touch. Over this way, goes through to the mezzanine area, which is currently my bedroom. That's just for for the sake of it. So yeah, and again, as I did, as I as I mentioned with the glass house, this is all being done legit. Everything collected, if not by me, by my little buddies. Uh, everyone from, uh, as I mentioned, uh, Ryan, my little assassin boy. Uh, clearly, you Sarah the dreamer our awkward penguin and also wiggles captain wiggles yay uh so heading downstairs and this is what i completed yesterday so i do have hey buddy these are the reason for the dirt okay so they don't go out during the day i got an i actually trapped him as a as a zombie villager before I turned him so that's why he's in a fence whereas this guy actually trapped him outside so it took a while to get him in I broke him through the floor to drop him down here and that's why there's some dirt on the stairs but yeah anyway my big chest room we are considering um, or at least you Sarah the dreamer and TG Adam are considering turning this server into uh, a public server so if we do there's a good chance that we may have a survival uh, so I'm going to need all of this chest room to help buy and supply. Uh, enough of the chest room, though. This is my baby. This is my baby here. Look at this. The no-brainer potion room. Yay! Glass benches. Endless water supply. Even though I do have a cauldron there, but uh, can't keep filling it up, so I've got that there. So look at this. Look at this. Look at this. If you ever need to know how to make, I did put all the bad. I've only got two of the bad ones because I'm not. I'm not like, that evil. Uh, you Sarah the Dream is evil, but I'm not that evil, so I'm not going to be making too many of the bad potions. Aww. I do loves this. I loves this, and my enchanting room over here. Clearly, a bit boring, but uh, but there you have it. And um, I don't know. I still haven't got a nether portal here, so maybe this little space here. These little two blocks will take you through to a room to a nether portal. Might even redstone a door to make it a secret entrance. That actually sounds like a really good idea. So that's it from me, folks. Uh, this has been Carrot Top on a weird and wonderful adventure of my, um, of my builds over the last three or four months. So I hope you've enjoyed it. Uh, I know I did while I was making it, and uh, remember to click that like button, subscribe if you haven't already, check out my friends as well, my pumpkin swaggers and elsewhere. Um, I've got some awesome buddies new to my um, to my YouTube groups, a couple of groups going on. So have a look through, see what you like. A lot of us are just new, so um, comments, everything's helpful. We love all the information. We love it lots. Okay, guys. So, again, thank you for joining me on this, uh, on this tour of something a little bit different. And uh, I'll see you in my next video. Bye.